Chang'eng is T1 of the server, bro. Absolute domination. I mean, people don't understand, like, experience goes a long way, and, uh, like, Chang has got experience, and they're just good. But, uh, but I mean... Uh, Ray's group, uh, they're definitely building a name for themselves, man. That's why I, I kind of wish... I don't really know why they're not a gang, but... I don't know. But like I said, gang or not, it, it wouldn't have changed the outcome. I mean, they would have lost all those sprays either way. <laughs> and if they try to go for one of Rust sprays, I don't think they would have even gotten near it before getting wiped, in my personal opinion. It wouldn't have really changed anything, so I don't know why people throw in that excuse. Oh, they don't, they're not a gang. They have nothing to lose. They wouldn't have lost anything. best for p now because now it really hurts no yeah that's what i was saying it was uh i've never seen like in all my years of RPing in gta like i've never seen a dynamic of a crew like losing so much actually losing so much from a war where they have to be like holy fuck like we're getting fucked So I do, I do like the, uh, I do like the turf stuff. It's very, it makes it, it actually makes it very interesting. But is Rust the one who removed 16 of CG sprays? Nah, I think that was a bug. <laughs> We're talking about Seaside. Take up gadgets will make wars different too. Yeah, I mean the server is the server is definitely uh, you know. I do think the update wasn't like a massive content update, but it was a massive update to build off of what seemingly looks like some good systems. Like the way you get banks now, you know, the way wars work now, uh, storefronts, which I know are scuffed as fuck, uh, it's pretty cool the way they work. <laughs> 